Hi friends, I'm Vaidya Pradeep Sharma from Sukhayu Ayurveda Jaipur. Today I'm going to present a case study of avascular ne necrosis of hip joint with you. Uh, basically, we have many uh, case studies of avascular necrosis where we have stopped the progression of uh, avascular necrosis. The basic thing uh, with avascular necrosis is that this is a progressive condition. The disease keeps on progressing and your surgeon, orthopedic surgeon or any surgeon keeps on waiting when the hip joint will decay and they will go for a replacement. We all know that the cases where they have done the core decompression are not that successful. The success rate is very low. With the Ayurvedic treatment, we try to resume the proper blood supply within the hip joint so that your bone can stop decay. And once the decay stops, the next curiosity comes to mind. Is it reversible? Yes, of course, it is reversible. And within this series, I will be presenting different, different cases with you. I will share the cases one by one. And I will let you to know that these are the cases where we have found marvelous results and things were reversed. Today, uh, the case study I'm uh, having in my hand, these are basically two MRIs of Mr. Malhotra. I won't disclose the identity of patient because of the nature of disease. Certainly nobody wants to share with a lot of people. Mr. Malhotra uh, was a case uh, which we denied in our very first meeting because it was in case uh, stage 4 and as many of our patients and followers know that we don't take cases which are in grade 4. And about that, over that, uh, he had gone for coding compression also. So it was a challenging case, case for us and that this kind of challenging cases give a lot of hope to me as a physician. We started the treatment and I will show you the MRIs that how Mr. Manotra is a hip changed its structure on the date uh, this is uh, 13th December 2017 his MRI says as you can see on the screen also that uh, there is marrow edema is seen in head and neck of femur the acetabulum shows chronic remodeling demonstrated by increase in depth focal marrow edema is seen in the subcondral region of the acetabulum, more in the posterior medial aspect. And this MRI shows very clearly that he has the bilateral head of femur affected with avian and the facet and arlet stages 4. And now that comes the next MRI with the comparison of the previous one done on the 13th December. This one was done on 15th December 2018. Few days back, this MRI says there is grade 3 on one side and grade 4 on the other side. It means where we had grade 4 on both the sides, now we have grade 3 on one side and grade 4 on the other side. So, friends, this MRI you can see on the screen now, as compared to the previous scan dated 13 12 2017. There is a mild interval decrease in the edema, which should increase certainly, because edema is such a thing which is representing the process of avascular necrosis and neck, including the acetabulum. It means in the femoral head, neck, and the acetabulum, in every place, the edema was reducing regularly. However, the area of involvement of the femoral head is stable on the right side and shows mild interval increment on the left side. So, friends, this, uh, this is a case which gives hope to many of you suffering with avascular necrosis. If you are suffering with avascular necrosis, Ayurveda can prove a boon to you and 
you can save your natural hips intact. And certainly, many patients are thinking now uh, after watching this video, your expectation will be like, oh, I can reduce my stage. It's not that important, as important is to stop the progress of the disease. Where you are, if you are in second stage and you are able to do everything, don't wait that your hip will collapse and you will go for a hip replacement. So on this note, I will take your leave. Thank you for watching. Stay with us, subscribe us and stay tuned with Sukhaya Ayurveda. Namaskar.